Hello, my name is Mordred Viking, and I'd like to welcome you to episode 28 of this Let's Play RimWorld. This is, of course, the usual suspects. In the previous episode, we fought off the mechs at last, and we cleared up a bunch of the polling jobs that we had set. Someone mentioned that we hadn't collected the gold yet. I'm fairly sure that is now in our storage. In fact, yes, I see it right there. So basically, we just hadn't got around to it. There were so many outstanding jobs that we just hadn't got to. We finally finished building this section up here. We have not yet got around to building any campfires in there, although the temperatures actually seem acceptable currently. And everything else is frozen. I think just the torches right now are keeping those things warm. It is the 7th of winter, so we are getting through that. We've been building some blocks. In fact, we've got quite a few right now. Interesting. And we've started using the categorized system here because we, quite frankly, we're running out of space. So I'm going to keep the meals open. I'm going to keep the food types open just so I can keep an eye on the amount of meat that we have. Meds are fairly self-explanatory. Everything else is pretty obvious. Okay, so what are the jobs for today? That is a good question. What do I need to get done? Uh, changing our defences, all of them, for sandstone would be a pretty good shout. So I might do that. Also, we need some more wood. Where's building materials? Is that building materials? No. That's just blocks. That's building materials. There we go. That's the one I need to open. Um, we do still have some wood down here. Yeah, there's a little bit. There's still loads of hauling jobs that need to be finished. And the hunting is an ongoing concern. So it doesn't look like there's many animals left out here. Oh, there's a bunch of wood over here. And some rams. We'll flag you to be hunted. We want to keep in the uh, food supplies coming in while we can. Oh, here's some more. Hunt them. Okay, that looks good to me. We've got a little bit of pemmican, we've got meat over there, that's all frozen. We've got all the mechanoids in here, we did grab one of the scyther blades, which is fantastic. I think we're just building the pots and things here. Uh, are we up and about, what time is it? Four o'clock in the afternoon. What is Mordred doing? Relaxing socially, building wooden plant. Um, I'm going to take a bit of a risk and I'm going to have all of these flags to deconstruct. So Mordred should do this pretty quickly. And then we'll have these replaced with sandstone. Alright, off you go. Do that first. Okay. And then we want sandstone wall. Up there. No. Nope. Work on these, for goodness sake. Uh, did someone just run past? Gorilla, you'll do. I need you to prioritise hauling all of this stuff. Off you go. Just so it's out of the way for Mordred. Okay, good. So, no. Fuck on that. Why? Okay, you brought a bunch of it with you that time. That's better. And you were working on it. Okay, good. So we need to make sure our outer walls are up and prepared. And that's going to mean that like the majority of our walls up here are actually now stone. I mean, this stuff is all wooden still. But it's, it's just a matter of time until we get around to switching those. Our construction skill is now 11. And a half-ish. Right, so everyone's going to bed. How is everyone's mood? One out of apparel, Madrani died, yeah, that'll be upsetting. Slept in the cold. You're in pain. I think that's just because you have your yeah, scars. You're a bit hungry, but you can get that tomorrow. Piper died, and you're hungry. So I think everyone's uh, mental health is actually pretty decent. The other thing that was suggested is that I should have buried Madrani in a sarcophagus. I think I might just do that. I think there is a debuff for digging someone up, but we're going to get a sarcophagus. And we're going to do the sarcophagi over here. Slightly different location. And we're going to say that this should be good quality. 
I don't know if the uh, quality of the thing matters at all. Or just having a meal. Really? You, you've, you've had enough sleep? Okay. Can you please prioritize these? Before you do anything else. So we really need to get our defenses up. Uh, deconstructing wouldn't... No. Stop that. Build. Oh, it's only because it's set to deconstruct, damn it. Forget that. Build those. Go and get some more bricks. There you go. Set these out and build them. Beautiful. No more deconstructions means that he does these first. Okay, so that will be the outer walls finished. Then I think I'm going to get you to do the sarcophagus. Buffy's got food poisoning. Mordred, major break risk. Yeah, you need joy. You need something. I want you to do the sarcophagus first, please. So we don't need to dig Matrani up when he's like desiccated. The body should still be frozen, I hope. Hey, bear cub. Normal quality. He's not good enough, is what Mordred is thinking. Are right, you getting a meal? Good. We have 14 of those. Ooh, we have some visitors. This stuff did get cleaned out, so that should be a bit of a nicer stay now. Research is still being done because I think pussy is still high priority. Yep. I think pretty much everything has been cleaned as well. So let's prioritize hauling again and deprioritize cleaning. So we can get all of this stuff brought in at last. Ward's playing horseshoes. Getting a bit tired. A bit of pain, why? Oh, you have a burn scar and a torn off finger. Yeah, okay, that'll do it. Oh, hang on. You're on the wrong kind of medicine. Let's go with on no meds. And we're being raided. Fantastic. Right, what are we up against? Preparing for a while before attacking Outlanders. Yay, the shoot off. Oh, flipping hell. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen of them. Sixteen enemies that we have to contend with here. Is that because the gold now counts against my wealth when before it didn't? I really hope not. And we only have one, two, three, four, five people who can fight. Although we do have a bunch of animals now. One guy with grenades, I think. Unless you do. Nope. We do have several Malias, but we'll just have to use the animals against you. Uh, it's not impossible. Especially if we let them actually hit our front entrance. So what we're going to do is we're going to restrict everyone to the walled and the animals into the walled area too. Let them prepare for a while and then when they're actually ready to fight, we'll fight them. And alpha beavers. Not too bothered about that because that is a source of meat. Alright, we'll just wait until tomorrow. I wonder if you guys are actually warm enough. And they're beginning their assault. Okay, so that would rather flag the moment that we need to jump to action. Do we all have our weapons? Yes, 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 and yes. So actually, we probably want some faster rate of fire guns than this. Let's go grab the assault rifle. 
Uh, no, not a survival rifle. In fact, a minigun might not be a bad shout at this point. No, you can get the LMG. I know that was Mordred's. Or the minigun. Just blanket of fire because there's so many enemies. And we want the animals. Not you, you're only a cop. To join us when we are fighting. Alright. Morty, let's put you here. No. Here. Pussy, you're behind that line. Oh, Numa, I'll put you in the front line. Where are we? No, we're probably not. We'll have you in the second line. Mordred actually can go there. Valnoma can go here. Okay. S Black. You back a bit. Alright, S Black, let's put you here. Could do with putting sandbags next to these firing spots. And here they come. It looks like they're going to be hugging the walls here. So maybe what we should do is have you over there. You over there. Where's the grenadier? There. Good. already. Okay, um, I would say that went pretty well actually. You have a bunch of captives. Um, right, you, go rescue Buffy. Let's have a look at the people that we've left behind. You have very low skills, your night owl prosper and you're ugly. Not necessarily bad things, you're an optimist heap lover with pretty decent skills. Can you haul? You can. So Grim would be a great choice. Pretty, Cold Lover, Psychically Dull. That's also another good one. You know what? All of these are perfectly reasonable. They've taken a fair amount of damage, so we're going to need some... Well, we have four prisoner rooms. So let's get them captured. We'll see. Let's have you rescue. Less black. Let's get you to get smelly. Alright, let's see if any of these guys are any good for us. That went really well. That went really, really well, actually. Just look at the number that we killed. Alright, good. Mission accomplished. Then animals can go back to the animal non walled and restriction unrestricted. Okay, cool. And S Black will need doctoring. Right, let's have a look at these characters. Well, we know that we want them. Oh yeah, we're definitely going to work on you. You're a bit more difficult, so we'll probably just release you. Might as well get some experience though. And you are probably also chat and recruit. So we'll have to release Grim. Grim was probably the best of them, but 96% is a bit difficult. So we are getting better at negotiation now. Kind of. Now we'll keep you for now. We'll have a friendly chat. 
I'll just do a friendly chat with you all. But we're going to give you all herbal meds. Get you healed up. SB Black, you are consuming pemmican. How badly were you wounded? Relatively. Let's just put you in there for now. And then Valinoma was the other doctor. I know S Black is one of the doctors. Right, triage time. Who's the worst? 158, 107, 61. Smelly is definitely in the worst shape right now, so let's get Valinoma to go and treat you. And what about the wolves? Who are you guys going? 68, 196. Oh, cripes. Yeah, you're actually the worst. S Black, let's go and get you to treat Buffy. And the bear is also pretty bad. So I think I'm going to work on the pets and then I'll get these two healed. And Bussy, how badly wounded were you? You're only bruised, you're fine. Alright, Val, tending to Kazuya. Okay. So the doctors are tending. That's the important thing. We do have sufficient meds for this to be possible. We'll just need to um, have some more out next time. Where is that? Are you going to bed? Not your attending Grizzly One. I would quite like you to go to bed, though you are bleeding very, very slowly. So you're not in a huge amount of danger. I think this is fine. Val, you're asleep. No. <laughs> really, Val? You have people that need your... your expertise. Uh, Grim. Right. You, right eyes treating Grim. Come on. What are you doing now? Relaxing socially. No, you're not. You're going to bed. And Val, as soon as S Black is in bed, you're going to treat him. There we go. Wasn't so hard. Now was it? Grim has been patched up. Right, everyone's been patched up. Pussy's up and about. Mordred didn't even get hit. Neither did Valonoma. That went really well. I'm surprised that went quite so well. Okay, so in the meantime, we need to fit everything and we need to get these bodies in here so we can strip them let's do that now oh oh are you actually going to bed you however are not Go haul Bonnie. Oh, we have a good quality shotgun, which we probably also want to get indoors somewhere. Haul him. Right, you can't haul that. Pussy. Training Buffy. Tuna, you're out. S Black, relaxing socially. Can we get you just to haul this? Shin. all of them? Yeah, I think so. Alright, that went pretty well. I'm happy with that. I'm happy with that. Shin major break risk. Did get the sarcophagus built. Tomorrow. Alright, why is everyone's need so low? You're just super hungry. Very ugly environment. Where are you? Oh yeah. What's been bleeding? Oh yeah, the animals were bleeding in there. Not that you can really complain if you do flip out. <laughs> what are you going to do? Just lie there more aggressively? 
Sorry, that's really not fair, but that's totally all we can really do. Is there anything else in here? That doesn't necessarily need to be. I don't think so. And who was it that had the minigun? I'll switch your weapons when you get up. I won't do it now though. That wouldn't be fair. Alright, so I think everyone's more or less healing up. Alright, well, playing horseshoes. Can you go and clean his room, first of all? Alright. Facing imminent breakdown. Alright, you can play horseshoes. Love him. Okay, I'll leave you to it. <laughs> Feeding simple meal. You will never clean. Where is gunning you? Alright, you're still. Oh, you're burying. Oh, hang on, hang on. Let's get you to use the normal sniper. That's probably a better choice. We have another normal sniper down there that we can use, and that would be for Valenoma. Though so you're using a normal assault rifle, which is also a pretty decent weapon. Friendly chat with all of these guys. In fact, no, screw it. Just chat and recruit. The sooner we get them on side, the better. Duke has actually been injured. Serious hypothet- oh crap. Um, There you go. Is that going to be a problem elsewhere? Possibly. So I think it's time that we really got some heating going. So we've got one there. And one there. Morty, where are you up to? You're building the whole campfire. good. And the other one as well. Excellent. Did you get the sarcophagus done? You did. Cool. Solar flare, that is irrelevant. The beavers are hopefully being dealt with. Right. Mitrani. Who's the most stable right now? Bussy, probably. I'll get Bussy to rebury Mitrani. <laughs> and we're going to assign this one to Mitrani. Bury him in the sarcophagus. <laughs> There you go. Who was it that was upset about Matroni's death? You were. That's decreasing. There's no modifier. Oh no, it was you who were the most upset. Shin. Buried in sarcophagus. Eight. There you go. That has actually eclipsed the fact that he died. Yeah, that's a bonus for everyone. Okay, fantastic. There you go. That is actually a really good tip. So in the future, if you have a colonist who dies, bury them in a sarcophagus. Very good tip. Thank you. All right, we're doing some repairs. Yes, they do need to be done. We have some more visitors. All right. Shin's having words with them. We have all the plant pots done. Mordi, what are you doing? Repairing sandstone wall. Men resting. You actually seem to have done all of your building work, which is kind of amazing. And the bears are being healed. We do need to do some cleaning, so I might set Mordred to do that tomorrow. And then really it's just hauling, and we're doing that. Right, we could do with another storeroom. The other thing that we could do with, which has been suggested several times, is cabinets for storing weaponry and equipment. Um, where would they be? Furniture? Equipment rack. How big are they? Double size. Now hopefully they can carry more than just one item in each point. And where are we suggesting that we put them? So I don't want them in the the way for firing. I'm going to put this, them in this room. And we'll have good quality. 
just so I can see how they work, and then maybe after that we will redetermine where to put them. This is kind of the spare room right now. Oh, these guys might be suffering from hypothermia. Is there another bed there? Use it. Alright, Morty's up, consuming simple meal. I think I am going to build some campfires in these other rooms. And we'll put one in here. Keep the visitors a little warmer. And we could actually just build a vent between these two. Uh, we'll do that when the rooms are empty. Falling wall. Mad animal. Local squirrel has gone mad. And we're being raided. A group of pirates from Armadillo's Crag. One, two, three, four, five, six of them. They have got much better weapons though. These guys are attacking us with charge rifles. I think that's the first time we've been attacked by charge rifles. They're poor quality and there's only six. So I'm really not too concerned about that one. Are they attacking immediately? Yes they are. In which case... Where has that squirrel gone? There you are. Alright, S Black, let's put you over here. Val, let's put you here. Quickly. Good, that's the squirrel done. These guys are on their way. Mordred and Bussy. Bussy, once again, we'll put you over here. Val, we'll put you here. That's black. You're a sniper this time. You guys might get attacked by them. Oh, you had a trader. We could have traded with you. Mistake! No, oh, you are in fact attacking me. Whoa, 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 no. Let's not do this. Mordred, let's not accidentally hit someone. Eh? Okay, now they're moving. S Black, Pussy, stay there, Val. Come here, Mordred, come here, go. Go, 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 go. Sniper. I'm having to fire at Seymour over there. Sarah has been shot to death. Who's Sarah? One of them, I assume. Whoa, 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 No. And they are fleeing. Um... Have a go, guys. Chief Angered, minus five. With them. Um, they're still pretty friendly. We need to do some work to really make them more friendly, though. And another one, crap. Yeah, a whole group of them died, didn't they? They were one of our few friends. Alright, how badly were you hurt? Ah, oh, just a few bruises. You're fine. What's the problem? Right, in the meantime. Let's have you. Right. Unrestricted. Morty. Paul Grigory. Bussy. 
Hole. Same one. S Black. Hole. Priscilla. Val. Hole. Vol. A bunch more weapons and things have become available. Uh, Shin and Gorilla, you can also do some. You can haul spider. Shin, you can haul orchard. Simple meal, you're holding, you're playing chess, you can hold them. Alright. Meanwhile, the last one in. Oh, it's going to be pussy, no. Where are you going? Burying. No, 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 no. Let's have you start stripping these guys. And you. So if you come over here and strip. Then at the end of this, I'm going to end this episode. So, thank you very much for watching. If you are enjoying this series, then please do hit that like button. If you haven't done so already, then please do consider subscribing as well. If you have any tips or advice to me, please do let me know in the comments. Thank you very much for watching, and I will catch you next time. Just hold this guy then I'm off. Ah, oh, strip even. There we go. Okay, I'll catch you next time. Goodbye.